This collection features 37 gold boxes, which have been collected over the course of about 50 years. These items are snuff boxes, or also called gold boxes. Like many things in life, it started with a human weakness, uh, namely the addiction to smoking, following the discovery of tobacco by Columbus in 1492. And in France, it soon reached the courtly spheres, where both smoking and a bit later um, taking snuff was extremely fashionable. And in order to contain the snuff, you would obviously need a container. These boxes were made to be carried around, so you would carry them in your pocket, you would give them to your mistress, you would receive one as a thank you gift. But they were very personal objects and as such also tell us a great deal about the period they were made in. The strong focus on this collection lies in the use of hardstone. We have bloodstone, um, we have different forms of agate. And then the most stunning examples of dressed and hardstone boxes, um, such as the Stein Kabinett. This one is particularly wonderful because it has this hidden compartment which contains a little booklet that lists all the stones that are used on the box. This one is a more female example. Very charming, very small in size, so definitely made for a lady, as things were back then. There are these three heartstone animal shaped boxes. So we have a little goat playing a flute wearing a jeweled tiara. And then we have these really charming boar um, and turtle heartstone snuff box. And they were included in a very prestigious sale in Monaco, which offered the collection of the Baron de Rede and Baron de Rothschild. This collection really has everything going for it, starting with the earliest box dating from the late 17th century to the mid-19th century. They're the perfect works of art, portable microcosms of beauty. 